All right, so here we are with beginning beekeeping in Texas. We are about to catch a swarm. Here's my uh, guarded mug. So, this is a swarm. If you've never seen one, they hide very well. And if you come back here, I, I pulled up and I've seen swarms and I didn't see them. So, I think what we're gonna do is do the snippy snip, do the snippy snip, and just take the whole thing and put it into a hive and let them kind of wander in. Cause the last time we shook them and then they went everywhere. So I think this will be a better deal. Looks like a pretty good size one. We shall continue. Show you the vessel we're gonna put them in. So here's our little snippy snip right there. Kind of the tools you have to have and this is one of the lysin nukes i really like these got some duct tape on the front so they don't escape <clears throat> so you kind of pretty sure this is a propolis trap so you can cut a propolis trap and put it like that otherwise they have way too much room and you can see where they've built comb in there and that's not what you want because the whole cluster will just sit up here and it won't go into the hive so we've got our frames new ones i put in a sort of built out comb just so they'll stay um, queen finds it immediately starts laying and they are more much more apt to stay if they've got uh if they've got some comb in there so let's make a little room Actually, we don't even have to do that because we're just going to lay them on top and hope they find their way in. This is a six frame nuke. Like I said, I really like these. These are from Lyson. So, I'm going to wait for my, uh, my helpers to get here. I don't need them right really but I think it's a really good learning experience um, they've done one swarm with me before like uh, last week so this will be a great little experience for them I'm trying to see if I can find any of them waggle dancing there's one kind of waggle dancing right there but she's not really waggling I just want to show you how calm they are you can just Put your finger right in there, and they don't care. They just kind of... Mm -hmm. See, there's one just really confused as to where she is right now. But she didn't sting me. So, there you go. So we're going to uh, capture this on my GoPro. Um, but I just want to show you what a swarm looks like in a tree. It's a small tree, thankfully. I mean, if you back up, you can see how they kind of blend in. Not really, but from the front, I couldn't see them. I mean, I drove up, you can't see them. Not really. So you really got to keep your eyes peeled if you're looking for swarms. <laughs> you can still see where I put my finger in there. I haven't really healed the hole. That's funny. Well, there's one kind of dancing. What they'll do is they will land on the, on the surface here and then they start waggling. You'll see them and when they waggle, they're waggling in the direction of where the hive is in relation to the sun. And the, the intensity of the waggle, so they'll really get going waggling. The intensity of the waggle is how far away their new uh, new digs is. I'm sorry. The intensity is how good it is, how uh, how um, 
good the site is. You know, they measure, they actually measure the space. They kind of spend. I mean, there have been some bees that spend have spent overnight at locations, measuring it and uh, seeing how it is. And then they'll come back and report. And then once they reach a consensus, they will uh, all go. The queen's in there somewhere. Well, this should be interesting. Let's see what happens. I will post uh, the capture on YouTube today. Just waiting for my uh, my assistants. You don't want to shake them. If they fall, if they lose their cluster, they will be everywhere, and they might go to a different tree. They might go higher. But they're perfect. They're right above my head, and I'm about six foot, so probably about six and a half feet up. All right. Let's see if I can find anybody waggling. Nobody's really waggling. So all the scout be. Oh, there's one waggling right there. I don't know if you can see her. trees moving so sorry all right well we'll go from here get this worm capture up as soon as we get it done wish I could just post my phone onto a uh, somewhere sturdy for you but I can't well, I guess my hands Well, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and uh, we'll get this up today. All right, thanks, guys. I also got some inspections coming later.